A cluster of the earthquakes has started in the Reconesta. That is the end point of the Reconest Peninsula, a peninsula in the Iceland which extends from the west to the east. And when we have the earthquakes in one location along that, usually it transfers to a series of a strike slip faults toward the east. We are lucky that the Reconest Peninsula is that in is in that lo uh, direction, longitudinal. That makes it very easy structurally to see how the uh, earthquakes are transferred. This is a peninsula, as I mentioned. It has geothermal activity there. We have a geothermal power plant there. And uh, past eruptions also have happened there. Like many parts in the Iceland, uh, is Iceland created by these activities. When modern earthquakes happen in one location, in the west, it gradually through these transform faults and volcanic system transfers toward the east. These are the strike slip faults that practically we discovered the plate tectonics by studying them on the ocean floor by the magnetic uh, stripes that we could see actually on our charts. And this has created these uh, volcanic systems, we call them. They are kind of bodinage landscape of fault lines and rift valleys in the Iceland. And uh, Usually they start in the Reconus Ridge in the Atlantic Ocean. Then they move through this uh, transfer uh, of the strike slip fault movements to accommodate the movement toward the uh, Reconus Peninsula. This is where the Earth crust is splitting. Atlantic Ocean was created in this way. And the roots of this is deeper in the mantle of the Earth, where we have the uplift and convection of the heat, heated material coming to the surface, North American plate and Eurasian plate practically are separated through this uplift of the material, through this extension of the oceanic crust, where everywhere else Gondwana was joining together, there we are splitting of the earth, and these are rooted deep in the core mantle boundary of the earth. Uh, we may have eventually an eruption, but not directly at this moment. But through this strike slip fault lines, we have these volcanic systems, including the Swartzengi volcanic system, which uh, is active at the moment, and we are expecting any moment an eruption there. It may eventually lead also to eruption in the Swartzengi volcanic system. We have to wait and see.